in keeping with the original design that I had for this pot, I want an Echeveria to be featured right here and it has to stand out against all the green, which means that it has to be a warm color or a darker color because it would contrast nicely against the sedums. I really enjoyed involving you in the decision for the other spot with the black pots. So I think I'll, I'll be doing the same for this spot. I'll be, I'll be giving you a bunch of plants to choose from and you could help me decide what to use here. So let me show you. So here's my short list for that area. As you can see, they are all of the similar hue. As you can see, most of them are dark and they range from dark red to purple. This type of color would look really well in that spot. Let me take you through my choices. So from the back row, this is a blue metal. This is an Echeveria Fimbriata. This one is an Echeveria Fasciculata. This is an Echeveria Mahogany Rose. This freely right here is an Echeveria Bittersweet. This small one right here is an Echeveria Chocolate. This freely is an Echeveria Black Opal and I imagine that it might grow large. I think of these, this two would be growing really large but time will tell. And this last one here is an Echeveria Catalops. Right now, please pay little attention to the state they're in. Because some of them have been bought recently and which means that some of them would be not looking their best at the moment. But yeah, I'll be picking from one of these and I need you to help me. You might want to jump back to the earlier parts of the video just to see them again. And please let me know what you think in the comments. But in any case, I'll be keeping them somewhere here so I don't forget that these are my shortlist. So there's lots of other plants out there and I might mix them up. So, okay. <laughs> I think I can place another red or purple one here. So rather than just the top choice, I'm going to go with the top two choices. So the first one will be going here. And the other, here. 